ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to our Minecraft server. Moni and I are going to play on the survival realm here, and I think we're going to try to stick with this series yeah. for a bit. Uh, one thing you'll notice is that I do have shaders on, which I really like, because uh, it gives the game a little bit more of a warm feel, a little less analog. Um, oh, yes, and don't pick on me. I'm half Ender. Anyway, let's go. And already we start off the game by her throwing me down a hole. I'm going to toss my dirt at you. Come here. Have some dirt. Oh, look. Look, 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 look. I what? Give you flowers, eh? you That's go. better. I like that. Okay, we need to get started. Uh, are we going to stay here by the spawn point? Um, I mean, we can stay close. Yeah, we need to stay close because what have our, you know, our, uh, oh, we got all kinds of resources. Now, we're paying, playing the, the claves, claves, the caves and cliffs update. So, um, we have, uh, all the new features that have come into the game, which is really cool. And, um, so we're going to be enjoying the world with caves and cliffs and this should be fun. Um, basically just to survive and we're going to mine and build our little homes and no, no massive goals as of yet, but we're going to just have a good time. So, all right, so let's get started. I'm going to head over, let's see. I'm going to get some wood. I've already got wood. I'm going to get some more. You, you build your own stuff. We'll help each other out as needed. I don't need help. Okay, well, you don't need help then. I think I'm just going to build my uh, my starting hovel in the side of a cliff over there by the lake. Oh, what, like your usual thing? Yeah, well, we never recorded, so... My usual thing is not what I normally do. Because I don't have a usual thing. The one thing that I like about the RTX version over this version is that the thing that was going to be my hole, but okay. Um, what? Never mind. And so the Are one. You because I took this coal? <laughs> yeah, no, the hole. Uh, but yeah, leave the other coal for me though. I need a couple pieces for the night. Why would I do that? Uh, do what? Take the coal or leave the coal? Leave it. I don't know. Uh, I do like the. In the RTX, you actually have glowing blocks, which I do like. Um, I like the textures in this better, though, for sure. Like, by a long shot, I think the Java version has better textures. Wait, where did it go? I saw coal over here. And, oh, I walked right past it. Um, let's not be stupid here. It's, I know that's hard for me not to do, um, but... Build a crafting table. Put that right here. And I'm going to take... No, I don't want the flower. I want these. We're going to make just one set of sticks. And we're going to make an axe. A wooden axe. For chopping down wood. And we're going to mm -hmm. make a... Um, one wooden pickaxe. Cause, hi, cow. Because by the time we get all this done, we're going to have some cobblestone pretty quick, and I'm not going to bother keeping the wooden tools. They're too slow and archaic mm -hmm. anyway. This actually might be a good spot to put our little hovel. Man, I'll tell you what. These shaders look great. Now, I'm using... So, for those of you that I haven't um, talked about the channel lately... Uh, Decided it was time to upgrade. I've had the 2070 Super for about a year. It was a great video card. really was. Um, and honestly, the upgrade that I made has not... Probably will not make a big enough difference until I go to 4K. Uh, but I did end up purchasing... Uh, my son got a 3080 Ti, and that sparked my interest. And uh, he then... you know, He was like, dude, if you go to Micro Center at the right time and just luck out... Um, you may find a video card. And I'm like, dude, because they're nowhere. Like, obviously, you guys have been watching the market and stuff, and these video cards are selling in, like, ten minutes. Like, they're just not, or less, two minutes, three minutes. Best Buy gets them in, and then they just disappear. So, I, uh, Moni needed some stuff from Best, from from uh, Micro Center, and uh, we had bought her a new computer. And so she got a computer with a 3090 in it, and a 1440 monitor. It's still not. It's still 1080p, which is not a bad thing. Um, but it's not. You know, I guess the 3090 really is great at doing 4K, which 
Eventually, I will upgrade to. Not this year, though. I've spent enough money on computer stuff. I don't want to spend. Uh, Plus, the, the the technology cost will come down. So, right now... Um, so, sure, can we'll, we'll replant that somewhere else. I'm going to put a door stop in here just for now. For now. We'll, you, we'll actually make a nice one, but... Uh, all right. What do I need? I need... Oh, uh, oh! It's I can get it from inside. <laughs> uh, so I went to Micro Center. My wife, we bought a monitor for her, and the monitor was broken. We took it out of the box, and it was cracked, and pieces were broken from the cables and stuff. I was like, what? Usually, Micro Center is really good about that stuff. So uh, we brought it back in and said, look, you know, we just bought this. We opened it up, and the thing was broken. And the guy's like, Ugh. but he took it. And uh, they, they refunded our money. But while I was there, I noticed this. Um, there was an RTX uh, 3080 Ti sitting on the shelf. And I'm like, oh, my gosh, dude, like, is that available? And he's like, you know, the guy's like, no, uh, I apologize. That's, uh, that's a customer already purchased that. It's sitting up there because he's going to come pick it up. And I'm like, oh, man. He's like, I'll tell you what. He's like, if you go fast right now and you get to the back of the store, we got more cards in. So I had been, Moni and I had been up there to buy her computer two days before, right? Was it two days or three days? Two. It was two days before. And um, I'm telling you what. Are you laughing at? No, I just, I'm looking, because it's cool. Like, I'm looking across at your thing. Look at your candles. Look. Like, I can see your little hut across oh, wow. there. You should load the shaders. Your computer can run them now. Keep oh, it at like awesome. keep it at like twenty chunks though. That way you're not your frame rates won't get choppy. Yeah, I need your help doing that. Yeah. All right, we'll set it up. Yeah, that's kind of a pain uh, to set up, but we'll do it. Uh, anyway, um, so we had been up there two days before, and when you went back there, of course, you know, no offense to AMD, but all the AMD cards are available, <laughs> and the Nvidia cabinet's completely empty. Uh, and so I was like, dang it, like I'm just I'm never gonna get one of these cards, and I was. Looking at building a new computer, but that's, you know, it, I was having a hard time deciding whether to do it or not because, you know, the computers are, mm, I want to say we were looking at, like, to build the same computer that Moni has, we got hers open box for 3000 right? Well, to build one like that, you're looking at 5000 plus, and I'm just like, man, I can't, I just can't justify spending that kind of money on a computer. I don't need it. Like, I don't need it that badly. For this kind of stuff, I do, you know, but I my computer is fine. Like, right now, we're recording and playing this game with all these on. I am actually using, uh, let's see here, 21% um, CPU. So my CPU is not bottlenecking. And even in Flight Sim, like, when I'm doing a lot of stuff, I'm still only using about, like, 60% of the CPU. So... It's not. It's never maxing out to 100% unless you're like loading something for like. So, anyway, my point is this: uh, I didn't really want to upgrade the whole computer. Plus, I have all my stuff on here. I've got you know all my business stuff. I've got lots of games installed. I've got four different hard drives with material on them. Ones for recording. Ones for my clients. One, you know, some of those are easy to transfer, but getting the programs, you know, I've got a. Things that I've picked up over the years, uh, like Binpin gave me a laptop that broke, and I took the hard drive out. Well, it's a two terabyte SSD that Binpin had put in there. So, I mean, those kind of things you just can't replace. You, I mean, it's like they're asking, you know, uh, I forget how I forget how much it was to upgrade uh, hardware. Um, I think I'll make two of these. I should probably have put more sticks in there. Yeah, let's do that. And then shift. There we go. We got them both. Um, but anyway, the, I can't afford, like, it makes the price of the computer like six, $7,000 to put the same kind of rig that I have together now because parts have gotten so expensive. So I just, uh, I was like, well, I mean, the best thing that I could do is upgrade the video card, uh, you know, and that'd be the cheapest option. So I, I went back to the cabinet where all this stuff was stored and lo and behold, they had every model of 30 series card in the cabinet. They only had one 3090 left, though, brand new. Yeah, they had a used 3090. Well, they only had one of each, yeah. they had, But they had a 3090. They had a 3080 Ti, which, honestly, I probably could have gotten away with. That was, uh, And they're expensive now, which is crazy to me. I've never spent more than usually about 250 on a video card. 
Uh, in a crazy day, I might spend 500 like I spent 500 for the the Super, and that was the most I'd ever spent on a video card. This card weighed in at like $2,200. I'm like, man. But you know what? We do I, – I make – Ten times that much through YouTube. So, you know, sometimes. Th this year I won't because it's been a slow year and I haven't been producing as many videos. But, uh, you know, with Farm Sim 21 com or 22 coming up, uh, I know that we're going to be making a decent amount of money next year because we'll have early access and we'll get people in and people can see it and all that stuff. So uh, the channel will have a big boost this year. So I'm like, you know what? It's worth it. I'll be using it for another two years. Uh, the other thing I bought was a... Um, I did get a 100 or 165 hertz monitor, so that helps me with the frame rates. Uh, though, really, most of the games are stuck at 60 anyway. It's not a huge deal, but uh, when 4K hits, I'll be able to do it because the 3090 is a 4K machine. And even 8K, they say, though. I don't know how long that'll be. I, I'm not going to buy an 8K monitor for a long time. I mean, I'm still not at 4K, so... But I'm going to have to, actually, for business, too, I need to, because the wedding company that I work for, pretty soon, our company's going to go to 4K. So I'm going to have to have a monitor that displays 4K anyway. So all of that stuff made it a good business decision. Like I said, I I balked a little bit because I'm like, dang it, 2200 bucks for a video card. But it is top of the line, and it will serve us well. Um, and it would be nice for you guys, too, because... The games are going to run smoother. Flight Sim already is, like, way better. Though, I will say in the cities, well, I can't believe I haven't found any kind of minerals or materials at all. Really high oh, are we? I mean, I'm I'm at 34. I'm not that high. Um, anyway, so that's, it's exciting news. Um, things like this, like we can, I can play Minecraft with shaders turned on. <laughs> And not have any frame rate issues. Some of you have been doing that for years. But for me, even though it was kind of weird, even the 2070 couldn't do that, which is kind of surprising because it's such a strong card. But the 2070 Super. But, oh well. The one thing that's harder about using the shaders is that the lighting definitely is way darker, like in these tunnels. You don't get nearly as much light. change that a little bit. Oh. Every time I every time my wife sees me she's like, "Change the skin." Does my little ender skin scare you, baby? Ah! See? Did you find coal? Yeah. Dang you. I've got nothing. I literally have come down like 20 levels and not found a single I thought for sure we'd run into something. Oh, well, at least everything we're using except for the candles is made of cobblestone, but at some point I'm going to run out of candles. Is it daytime yet? I guess it doesn't really matter, does it? Ah! Finally, a mineral. Coal. So we are going to use one cheat, um, and that is if I collect enough materials. Oh, my goodness. What? What? You found a cave? Oh, by the way, so yeah, this is Caves and Cliffs. And I was going to say, the one cheat that I am going to allow for myself and for my wife if she wants, if you collect six rabbit skins and two uh, spider ah! strings, ah! Ah! she's dying. Uh, if, we, if you collect those items, we are allowing bags to be made. Uh, one of the new features in the game is a, like a carrying purse. And it's really nice because it allows you to carry way more items in your in your inventory than um, you normally would. So we're going to be uh, doing that. So we're going to have... Ah, you... <laughs> Don't be going into the caves yet. You're not ready. You need armor and stuff. You just dig your own mine. Don't, don't it go spelunking. Oh, shoot. I'm not sure where we were. Uh-oh. We're just to the right. When I started, we were just like to the right by the lake. You'll find it. Just go, in, go around in like a little circle. You know. What the frig was that? <laughs> what have I what have I hit? 19 is where I'm at. All right. 
So the good news is we have more coal. We can continue our mining operation. I'm going to work for some coal and iron. And get that to you. Ouch. More coal. Sweet. Ah, copper. First sign. We have copper sign. So copper is a cool metal. I'm not going to... How do hey, I put this? Who, me? I'm not taking your stuff. Did I turn a corner? I did. How did, how did I... Weird. Okay, well... Uh, we'll use it to build things, but we have to have bees. We need to make beeswax so we can... If you polish the copper, it'll stay gold. If you don't, it'll tarnish. Though sometimes the tarnish look is pretty cool, too. Especially, like, in a jungle. He got you again? Now, this is cool. I didn't realize this. this the shaders have a rainbow outline for the stuff that you pick. All the stuff. Uh, that's pretty neat. All right, so I'm going to keep mining here, guys. I'll come back if I find anything exciting. Hopefully, you're going to enjoy this series. We're going to definitely have fun. We're going to build some stuff and have fun. And I'm not the greatest builder on Earth. I tend to think very square. Uh, but I'm going to work on it. We'll see if we can come up with some neat designs and make a cool house. Oh, my God. Leave me alone. My poor wife. She's getting lambasted. All right, see you in a minute. All right, so real quick here, I just want to pass this on. We're encountering our first of the caves and cliffs. Uh, upgrades. We have, this is a new material called Tough. It's actually, it's like nether material. See how easily it breaks? And that's with the stupid axe. I went down too far. I'm actually at 9. I'm going back up to 11 here. I, the, uh, I don't, the game has not apparently changed yet to the lower diamonds. They will be, but they haven't yet. Okay, so we need to put a torch. Oh, I'm out of torches. I'm about to be out of everything. So, anyway, I'm going to take a break here, grab my wife a cookie, and then we're going to build a crafting table and build some more torches because we're out of light. Actually, I can do torches without that, but my axe is going to break too, so we'll be back. Hold on one second, folks. Well, one thing I didn't anticipate was that we were going to run out of wood. So I'm here, and I've got one pickaxe left and about eight candles. So we're going to have to go back up to the surface here pretty soon and get some more uh, wood. In the meantime, we're finding a lot of coal, so that's good. We'll have resources to cook things with. Leave me alone! You leave, leave yourself alone. Uh, and then uh, I'll go ahead and mine all this crap out. Uh, we're not going to get that anyway because we don't iron. Just leave the redstone. I forgot. You need an... I think this is coal, too. Yep. And that's the new... This is the new type of rock. Um, it's harder to see the materials, for sure, with uh, with shaders on. Uh, and because uh, it's dark, you can't tell that it has stuff in it. There's some uh, deep slate, I think. Let's see what that is. Yeah, cobbled deep slate. Makes a cool... Cool building materials. It has a lot of options as far as building goes. Uh, you can do all kinds of stuff with it um, with a with a stone cutter. So it's pretty neat stuff. Um, hey, I'll leave you alone. Sorry. Saws. All right, guys. I'll be back. I'm gonna go ahead and do some more mining till I th the, till this thingy breaks. There's some diamonds. Hmm. Let's mine out around them. I can't I can't take them with me right now, but we'll. We'll come back for them later. Wow, look at all of those. Uh -huh. Stay out of my mind. My wife is actually really good. She always shares her diamonds. She's like, here, have some diamonds. I'm like, stay away. Those are mine. How much lower does it go? I've already seen that block. up 
there. Nothing. It's my understanding that these actually travel in veins. So some travel. They, they're they set in veins. So sometimes if you dig around, you can find other ones uh, that aren't connected. But anyway, there we go. So there's a nice heap of diamonds. we got five right there. I think I'm going to try to wait until I have a fortune pickaxe, if I ever can get that. Uh... We're not here. What are you doing? No, you that's cheating. <laughs> Why'd you give me that? You are nice. Well, I suppose we could mine out all I'm gonna leave these, but eh. No, thank you. Thank you. I still haven't found iron. Did you? Where did you find iron in your cave? Yeah. Wow, just not lucky today. I got two candles left. That's as far as we can go, and then I got to go back up to the surface. Coal? I have tons of coal, oh, okay. and it looks like it's gonna gonna have tons of redstone. I'm gonna probably wait till I have fortune I for that too. Yet. You can take some of mine if you want. I'm hearing lava. And that's it for the candles. I'm just afraid. I hear this lava. I'm afraid I'm going to pop one of these and lava's going to come pouring out. Stranger things have happened. All right, I'm going to keep mining this coal pocket, and then I'm going to head up to the surface and get more more candles. I'll be back. Actually, we could, you know what we could do? Um, these never work real well, but we could. Make some redstone candles. Oh, wait, I can't. I don't have wood. <laughs> Duh, I have coal. I just don't have wood. Hello, Blaine. Okay, we'll be back. I'm going to head up to the surface. Well, I went upstairs, and it was still the middle of the night. So I decided to mine my way over to this lava and see what we got. Death could be one of those things that it has. It does have a build-off, though, so we can do that. here while we still no iron I haven't found a single thing of iron man it's funny how some of these biomes just don't have what you need well, mine does. yeah mine doesn't have you been finding a lot of iron though or just a couple pockets I'm just unlucky I guess Not too keen about exploring dark caves with no weapons or armor. That's why my wife died like 15 times. Oh, it's a mine. Oh, it's a mine. I don't know if you guys can even see that. It's so dark, but we're going to go back down. We'll save that for another day. And let's see where's my shaft. <laughs> I'm going to put these right there. That way they can see us, we can see them, but they won't come through. And then I'm just going to have to wait for daytime. I'll be back. And so the moon goes down, which means that hopefully soon the sun will be coming up. Look at that scene. It's beautiful. And it's down. The sky is turning pink. Still need that sun to come out, though. <laughs> We're just going to wait. Oh, what is that? Oh, the sunlight is traversing. Pretty soon, the baddies are going to start catching on fire, the mobs. 
Except for they're probably just going to hide under the trees. That's what they do. And we need more wood. We also need to build a chest so that we can store our stuff. In. Uh, do you have shears yet? No. Have you made a bed? Yeah, if you have iron, you should, we should probably make shears, because otherwise we're going to be dealing with phantoms. Because what is this, day two? I'm just going to chop a bunch of trees down. Look at that. It could be... I'm trying to figure out why we're lacking diamonds. Or not diamonds, uh, iron. I'm not lacking iron. I'm just saying it's not... Usually you find tons of iron everywhere. It's not producing like it normally does. And maybe it's because we're so close to the water. All right, I'll be back, folks. See you in just a few minutes. I'm going to chop some more wood. All right, so I, I should have collected a sufficient amount of wood by now. Hi, Annie. Hi. How's it going over there? And we're going to hop back down to our little abode. Ow, that was not what I was intending. Oh, hold on one second, folks. All right. Um... So what do we want to build? First of all, we need to make some wood. And we're going to take it. We're going to just make a bunch of blocks here. All right, so next, I need to make some more. Definitely more. Actually, we're going to make more of these. Stop it. Okay, 21 sticks. A lot, of, a lot of torches. 64 torches. Put those right there. And good. And then we're going to make, uh, let's see. We're going to make a, where's cobblestone? I'm going to make two more pickaxes from cobblestone. Hopefully we'll start finding iron sooner or later. Uh, next thing we need to make, um, Make two chests. Make a double chest here. We're gonna put that right here. And yeah, we can pop some of this stuff in there. I may I might use some of this for building. Yeah, we want that stick. Uh we're gonna use that for our garden. Definitely gonna keep that. We'll just tough. I don't know how much of this we're gonna keep, but I'll burn. I want to keep the birch as decorative, so we'll keep that. Uh, cobblestone, cobblestone. we got a lot of cobblestone. But you never know. We probably aren't going to use much cobblestone. We'll use deep slate. But we'll see. Um, I'm not sure how I'm going to build the house yet. I don't have any good ideas, but I want I want to do something really cool. So Torches. i got our iron pickaxe from my wife. I'm going to save that so that if we run into something that I can't break with stone... We'll use the iron one, and hopefully we'll find some iron today. All right, I'm going to head back down into the mines. I'll uh, let you know when I find something. I'll be back. And finally, after making this huge uh, channel, I've got two pieces, maybe more. There's some more. Got some raw iron. Does that drift anywhere? No. Shoot. And that's it. We got a big lava pit over here. Let's take a look. Uh, coals over there. Not worth it. Ooh, cool. That look into that. See if you get potatoes. Sometimes they have potatoes in their chest, and that's that's a pretty big deal. Because potatoes will provide us with a pretty endless food source. I know you're aware of that, but that's for the sake of our viewers, darling. My wife's quite the good Minecraft player, more than I am. 
Um, all right, so... Except for she dies all the time. Because she's reckless. Like Brian Adams' album. Reckless. All right, I'm going to keep mining. See you guys momentarily. And we found some mobs and some iron. This is good. This is very good. Do you want to come on the buried treasure map with me? Why don't you save that so we have suits of armor? Like, it's really, really bad to go venturing out until you're all set. We're not ready yet. But yes, I will. But save it for now. Or don't. You're already going, aren't you? No, I'm not. Okay. Did you find any taters? See, you shouldn't go wandering until you have a compass. <laughs> Make a compass. You have redstone and, a, and iron? You don't have any redstone? Oh my gosh. <sighs> babs, babs, babs. I can't help you. I don't know what to tell you. You want the coordinates? do that. Let's see. The, the coordinates are going to be X, Y, Z. 286 by 12 by negative 162. 286 one six, negative 162. Those are easy to remember because 286 is a processor and 162 is a road by my house. Is a route. We're on we're on eleven, right? Yeah, eleven. <sighs> it's dark. Okay, I'm gonna go back to mining. See you guys in a minute. <sighs> a whole lot of mess. Those sound really mean, whatever those are. Um, all right, so... no. Oh, look what I missed. And, of course, it's over the lava. Dang it. Like this. It's over the lava. It is over the lava. The iron is over the lava. I'm just collecting the redstone. See, there's iron. It's over the lava. Over the lava. They sound hungry and unhappy. So I must have found somewhere nearby is a zombie spawner. Which could, if we know that it's there, it could... I'm not ready to face them yet, though, but it would be good to have that so that we can use their experience. And once again, this just goes back here to a dead end. Here's all this deep slate, new cobblestone. It's all new for the game. All right, so we've got our iron out of here, and I'm going to continue on. All right, I'll see you guys in a minute. We've arrived upstairs. In our home, the sun is up. Okay, so today we are upstairs. We're still part of the same day. And we're going to save that. We're going to make cobblestone. We have cobblestone out the wazoo. Oops. So what I'm going to do is this. Oh, I've broken all my pickaxes. I have to make one more cobblestone one. That'll be the last one we ever make. Uh, who, who's to say? I'd like to think this is the last cobblestone axe we've ever made. Did you get any bed stuff yet, or are we going to be dealing with creepy monsters all night? Did you stay well, I know that, but... All right, so put this here. Drop that in there. Let's put that. One, two, three, four, five. What was it? 
Uh, I'll tell you. We are at two, three, four, negative two, six, zero. We're gonna burn this off, and then I'm gonna burn some cobblestone. What we're doing is we're going to make a blast furnace to cook the rest of this stuff. I'm also going to make a stone cutter. Oh, does, now I see your name tag. does blast furnace need smooth stone or just stone? It needs smooth stone, doesn't it? I can see my house. <laughs> totally. Same room, different world. Yep, exactly. Exactly my point. Are you on me? Um, a little. I do need some food, so while those are just going to cook, and it's going to cook off, we're going to jump in the lake and see what we can see. I'm hoping we find some fish in here, but it doesn't look like it's going to be very fishy. Oh, sorry. My wife needed the coordinates. Now we have no fish in our lake. Wow. Oh well, it's a good bathing lake, I guess. I don't like swimming in lakes where there's lots of fish anyway, because it's kind of creepy when they touch your toes and stuff. It's like, eh, get off me. Uh. Yeah, it's not a nice feeling. It's a good feeling. Deep down inside. Alright, I think we have to go one more stage. And we're gonna build a cut we're gonna build a blast furnace here. I'm pretty sure this will not work. Yep. So what we need to do is we need to go here and we need to put in the stones and let them bake another level. I'm gonna take that out. I don't I think we can get all three of those without starting more coal. In the meanwhile, while that's cooking, we're going to put this over here. Oh, you know what? Uh, we can store things a little bit more easily by putting them into blocks. Especially things like redstone, where they just take up so much space. You get a lot of redstone. Then we can go in here, we can put the redstone and the regular redstone. Did it make it? No, oh, shoot, we got one more piece. Okay, and then uh, we can also, we could do the same with coal. When we have 64 and 40, we can take this and kind of boil it down to a, a more palpable number. Shift, there we go. Yeah, we'll take a block of coal. Now, I would not recommend using blocks of coal in the oven. Um, though I might want to. If you need to go back, you can go, yeah. You actually don't need a crafting table either. You can. There we go. But for storage purposes, we can cut that back a little bit. There you go. Um, put all these together. I will be going through the rocks soon. We don't need all these rocks, but. Alright, so that's done, right? Three of those. And I need to grab, actually, three more cobblestone and another piece of coal. Put those in. And the sun is going down, so we'll be back in the mines tonight. Um, so we're going to take this. We're going to take our smooth stone, put that underneath, and take these over the top. And we have a blast furnace. Pretty cool stuff. Um, and then we're going to pop that right here. And we're going to fill it with coal. Mm, that's good enough, probably. We'll put our iron in there and get that cooking. And while we're at it, we got a lot of cobblestone. We might as well make one of these. So we're going to go ahead and make our cobblestone stove. Our furnace. And then we're going to take one, two, three, four... And we got a smoker. 
So now we have all kinds of ways to prepare and cook things. Though I don't have any food to cook. I do need food soon. I have food. Um, I mean, you don't have to give me your food. I'll, I'll get it tomorrow. I'll just I'll kill some fish. Okay. I'm going to go fishing or a cow or something. What we really need are beds. I've got some wool. How much wool? I'll I've got three pieces right now. Well, I guess make yourself a bed, and then I'll work I on it. Because I'm going to, um... Are you sure you don't want a piece of chicken? Yeah, I can handle it. I'm gonna, I'll, be, I'll survive. Okay, so we're going to put these three here. I'm going to take one of those. Dink, like that. Okay, so now we have a stone cutter. And what that will do for us is that allows us to make stairs and polish this and polish that with our, um... out of stone. So we have our little hovel, but it's a very rich hovel. It's full of equipment and industry. <laughs> and we have 23 more pieces. I'm just going to let those cook. I'll see you guys shortly. All right, while I'm making, while I'm waiting for that to cook, we are going to make stairs for our mine so we don't have to hop all the way up. So what you do is come over here to the stone cutter, throw that on there, and we just press shift, and we're going to get 64 cobblestone stairs. That probably will be enough. But we may have to add more. And there's going to be places where we have to chop the ceil ceiling out, too, because we're going to end up hitting our heads. You'll see. Oh. Huh. More raw iron. Here I was complaining about there not being iron. It's right in front of my freaking fat face. I want to get that up there before... Ugh. We need to get up. I want to put it in the oven before we run out. So it's... Uh, come on! Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, throw those in. There we go. Uh-uh-uh! <laughs> you didn't say the magic word! Okay, so we're going to put this... I hate this hacker crap. nose for a minute. Did you hear the scratching noise? That was me. Oh! Shoes and socks. That went in upside down. There we go. And hmm. this would probably be better if we that. Come down to a landing. There we go. And then we go this way. 18 stairs left, but I think we're almost to the bottom. 12, 11, 10. We're at the bottom. <laughs> and we got to chop that out of the top so we can get our head through. Voila! Easy Access Mine by Arthur Chapman. <laughs> Simples. Alright, there we go. So we now have a staircase into our mine. We have some finished iron. I'm going to walk up to the top. You guys can go look at that. So much easier now to... Oh. <laughs> this is going to happen along the way. I probably have two or three of those that we have to stop. And, eh, maybe not. I cut this mostly right. Ta-da! Oh, and it's nighttime still. Dang it. But we have all of our iron. 45 piece. So what are we going to do with all that iron? Well, I don't know. Let's see. What do we got here? Four pieces of coal left there. 11 here. I guess we need to probably take our coal and use it more. Okay. So we'll put 32 in there. Eh, like 10 in there, 20. Actually, you probably don't need that many in here because we're not going to be using it for that much. 7 and... 
Good. Okay. Uh, that should do. And let's come over here, and we're going to make a couple things. Uh, first of all, we're going to make an iron pickaxe times two. One of those. Two of those. All right. Cool. And we're also going to make an iron axe just for a weapon because those are they make good weapons. All right. So there we go. And what else do we need? I guess. I don't want to make a suit of armor yet because I don't. I want it to wear evenly. So we're getting closer to the Iron Age. We're gonna finish off that pickaxe. We can put these steps in there. Oh, I have 36. I thought it. It only. It said I had 11. I must have not seen that properly. Okay. Well, I guess. Um, oh, definitely we're gonna do this. Uh, okay. So. Put one of those there. And some of these here. And one there. There we go. So now we are protected with the shield. And an axe. Wham. Hopefully we won't need it, but it's there just in case uh, we do. So. So I'm going to hang out for a little bit. Once the sun comes up, I'm going to grab some food. And we'll be back. So I'll be right back. All right, the sun's come up. It's time to go into action. We're going to go make some breakfast. And then in real life, I'm going to go make breakfast. So we'll call that an episode once I've cooked some dinner and eaten it. I'm hoping that we can find water with fish in it. Because the fish are the easiest to kill. And they're when they are around, they're plentiful. I don't think these lakes get deep enough for fish, though. No. Nope. It's kind of surprising. All right, well. And I don't want to go too far, because I do tend to get lost pretty easily. Um... So this hill comes over here. Oh, there's a big lake. There's got to be some fish in here. I'm going to be shocked if there's nothing in here. Maybe it's too cold. I don't know. I don't know what kind of biome we're in. If it's, It looks like it's deserty, but... <laughs> I've also seen snow in the desert, so... Got kelp. No, it's definitely not. It's definitely. There's tropical fish. That's not good. We can't use those. You can't eat tropical fish. Dang it. Nope. None of these. It's cool stuff, though. I love tropical fish, but. <gasps> Puffer fish. I tried to swim above him, but... I've got meat here. <laughs> Thank you for the offer. I want to find my own meat. Bye. You know how I am. Stubborn to the last. Ooh, that's pretty. Okay, <laughs> focus. There's some there's a bee. Ow, behave. <laughs> uh where let's see what else we got. We have nothing here. Looking for trout. Salmon? Anybody? Hello? Excuse you. Huh. Shocking. Oh, you know what? I never made clippers. Dang it. Can you get some wool? I thought you didn't want my help. Um, 
I mean, I can make them. I've got the iron for it. Oh, thank you. I'm actually surprised we don't have phantoms yet. We do. Oh, we do? Okay, so we're gonna in order to catch meat fish, we're gonna have to make a fishing pole. Which means I have to kill a spider at some point. But in whoa. That was a big hole. <laughs> oh wow, that's crazy. A waterfall into the cave. That's really actually it's broke. Let's fix that. There we go. Interesting structure. I'm just going to car carry around a block of sand for no reason. All right. Back to the task at hand here. Oh, sea turtle. Hi, turtle. Oh, I see. I see meat. Piggy. Oink. Oink. You're missing the point. I'm trying to record myself getting meat, okay? Whatever. Pork chop! Is that a baby cow? No, that's a full-grown cow. I'll probably regret that later. Okay, let's head home. So we've got enough meat now for for days. So once we've got a suit of armor and a compass, which we can uh, can already make a compass, um, I'm going to go on a big journey, on an adventure, really, to look for potatoes. Ouch. Man, I just broke my legs. Because I'm a big man. And I need a big adventure. But right now... I just need breakfast. Do, 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 do. Welcome home, everybody. We've arrived. Time to put things in the cooker. And the smoker. Do you have a bed, babe? Are you home yet? All right. I'll come over. Yeah, there we go. Smoked meat. Let's eat that. I'm hungry. Eat that. <laughs> Steak's awesome because it's so proteiny. Should probably put my iron here and not carry it around with me as I wander the earth. What do I need to make with iron? I guess I've got a weapon and I've got stuff to mine with, so I should probably take the rest of this and no, start. No. Come, come on in. Hello. Hi. I love ya. Oh, thank you. What's that? Why'd you give me cobblestone? <laughs> Do you want your cobblestone back? Nah, sorry. Uh, oh. Great. <laughs> Thanks. I'll be your garbage disposal, I guess. And then... <laughs> Alright, we got a bed. Thank you, honey. What a nice neighbor. And wife. Okay, so I'm going to... Uh, where are we going to put this? This does not make a safe bedroom. Aminals will come at nighttime and attack me. Uh, I guess. Or my wife, yeah. There we 
go. There's a cozy nook bed in my staircase. Um, all right, so we are where we we were here, and we're doing this. Mm -mm. We might almost be ready for an adventure. I don't know if I have enough. There's enough to make pants. Is there enough to make a breastplate? There should be. Yep. There we go. Boom. Okay. So we got a suit of armor. So in the next episode, we're going to go on the search for potatoes. Why potatoes? Because they're a never-ending source of food. Glorious food. Um, and so we could just start cooking them. We don't have to kill the animals in the area. We can use those for other purposes. And uh, so it's important to be able to go out on an adventure. And so we are going to do that in the next exciting episode of Minecraft. Ladies and gentlemen, hopefully you enjoyed this video. I had fun making it. We will see you in the next exciting episode. Have a great night. Be sure to subscribe. Thumbs up always help. And we'll see you tomorrow in Minecraft land. Goodbye.